Richard Parks, Pipe Major of Fingermans and Montgomery, Pipe Band. It's my pleasure to record this short video to give a tribute to Ian Duncan in preparation for the Names and Faces concert to honour his contribution to pipe bands worldwide. Ian's record as a pipe major is out there for everyone to see. Not only did he take a band from Grade 4 to Grade 1 in seven short seasons, he also took that band on to the top of Grade 1, winning major championships in the late 1980s. Great talent, great achievement, not only to teach the players to get to that level, but to take them on to the top level in Grade 1. But what do I remember of the Vale of Athol pipe band under Ian? I remember their music. Great music from around the world, innovative music which they all seemed to enjoy playing. That seemed to be what they were all about. The Vale were out there to try and play music that they enjoyed playing and they enjoyed presenting it to the public. And that was what they were all about. That was music that also inspired me uh, in my musical direc direction in future years. So thanks for the inspiration, Ian. So what else do I remember in the Vale? I remember they came across the Northern Ireland on a number of occasions. They came across the play in many band competitions in Armagh, and I remember competing against the veal, and I remember the great crack and the camaraderie in the hotel thereafter. Great memories to have of competing against the veal in Armagh in the 1980s. They also came to the, uh, the famous Ballymena County Hall concert, I think it was 1990. And that, again, that was a great night, full of great music and a, a concert to be remembered. Um, and I know a number of people in Northern Ireland always remember the, the concert in the Ballymena County Hall from the Vale of Athol Pipe Band. Anyway, um, I'm sure the concert, the Names and Places concert, will be a great success with the previous members of the Vale um, playing the great music. Um, and Ian, there's no one uh, deserves it more. And thanks for the inspiration. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna finish off with a, a wee statement on the back of the No Reservations album, and it says, "If we hear it and like it, we play it." And what a great uh, motto that is. And that came down from Ian at the top of the band. So all the best, and thanks for the inspiration. Ian.